So we have made our flight to Thessaloniki. So bag drop closes at 4.15. We got there at 4.10. Went over to a guy, he rang through and very, this is like, I've never even heard of this happening. He opened it all up. Wow, it's boiling. He opened it up and we were able to put our bags in. Then it wasn't over. We had to then run through security because this is one of the planes, you know, we got to get the bus. So again, super strict on timing. Now we're on the plane. That's all. That's all, Lindy. Greece. arrived at Dion and it took us oh my gosh if I actually work it out we left the house at 4 a.m so it took us seven hours to get here so it's close to Mount Olympus which is where the Grecian gods were supposedly to have lived the place is a spa like a spa resort so we've booked in for some massages and so yeah I think we're going to do some activities maybe go out see if they have ones where the hotel can take you out um and yeah the room is cute i'd say it was a bit misleading the um advertisement it was supposed to be a five star resort and i would definitely give it three and a half four if they did some repairs but it's cute and everyone's really friendly all the staff are super nice some bathing time over and out <laughs> So, quick change, um, yeah, the other room just wasn't up to standard, could not stay there, so we upgraded to the bungalow with a private pool, much nicer room, so they very kindly upgraded us, and yeah, now the holiday can really begin. Good morning! Oh, so guys, I have to show you this breakfast, he went to go get it from the buffet instead of just doing room service because we forgot. Okay, tea with no milk. I like, I don't even drink cow's milk, but there's no milk in this. Some definitely not fresh orange juice, so orange. Some bread, Nutella, and then some stuff over there. I think that's a sausage. I don't even eat sausage. So. Oh my, I just, I just don't know what to think. Like, we have been, we've been, we've been taken for a mug. We've been taken for a mug coming to here. This is supposed to be a five star place. And it's bloody, it's bloody not. It's bloody not. So I'm just going to stay in bed all day. This holiday's turning out to be very different than I expected. Morning, everybody. So I finally left the hotel room and have made it to the pool. The weather's super nice today. I think it's going to be like 35 degrees. Not 35. Oh my god! Wow, 25 degrees, um, which is good. So I think today we're just going to chill by the pool. We're going to go and have a look at the beach. They were pretty far away from everything, so the town is like 30 kilometers away, which I think is far. Um, so yeah, we're just kind of chilling. We'll show you some of the scenery. spent the day by the pool. I did not put any sunscreen on. I put it on afterwards, which just makes no sense. So that is a warning. Do not put your sunscreen on afterwards. It's just pointless. But now we're gonna go and leave the room again. Oh, hello. Leave the room again. I don't know where we're going, because we're somewhere on the beach. So yeah, let's show you that later. <laughs>
Hello and welcome to the finale. I know I didn't even speak that much, but um, I'll probably say it was the worst holiday that I've ever been on. So, first of all, how to describe the place? It reminds me of like a DIY. It's like you do it yourself, a DIY spa resort. Like it literally made no sense. Everything was so poorly done poorly put together like things just were just like it just didn't make sense the staff was so nice so lovely so welcoming but oh the place was just not what i expected i think the advertising is very favorable to exactly what it wasn't five stars spa resort blah 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 i'd give it a three and a half and I know everyone's standards are different, which is why I was a little bit annoyed because, you know, I normally do my research and everything because I know what I want. Like, I know when I'm paying for something that I want it to be the top of the top. Otherwise, I will pay cheap. And so this holiday was like a bargain. We thought, like, oh my God, it's so beautiful, so nice, so modern, fresh. Like, I didn't know exactly what I like. And it was, it was literally like someone read on the internet how to, how to create a hotel, how to create a spa as well, and this is what you got. There was nothing to do all day, there was literally nothing to do. There was insects everywhere, which was fine. They can't help the insects, but they were just like every kind. Oh, it was just not nice. So I ended up not leaving the room at all, which is really great, but it was supposed to be a chill holiday anyway. I was supposed to refresh, recharge before October, November. It's fine. So I'm really happy to be home, happy to be back doing my normal stuff. And yeah, so I have another video coming out. So watch out for my next video. It's going to be a day in the life. Um, this is like a very brief few days for my day in the life. I'm actually going to make sure that I do a very in-depth look. It's exactly what I get up to. Um, yeah, see you next time guys. Have an amazing day. Rock it because you deserve it.